Hey guys, it's Fear, and today I'm here to show you the Too Faced Country Palette. It's a palette of nine shades, five of which are new. So I'm going to show you the Nashville Nudes Collection. I'm swatching these on Too Faced Shadow Insurance because I always wear eyeshadow primer if I'm wearing eyeshadow. Otherwise, my eyeshadow is gone in 20 minutes or less. The first shade here is Cowboy Take Me Away, and it's a sheer peachy nude that looks like it has a, gold, a little bit of golden iridescence to it. It's got a satiny finish. This next color is Ya All. And it looks like sort of a peachy brown with a little bit of shimmer. The third shade is Dolly, which is a super pigmented dark brown. And it's got like a little bit of like soft satiny sparkle to it. That was the day look. This is uh, the first color in the classic look. And it's famous in a small town. It's sort of like a white with like golden sheen to it. This next shade is Paper Roses. And it's like a peachy pink with golden iridescence. I can see it being a very popular shade. The third shade is Rhinestone, which is like a plummy brown with silver sparkle. Um, it's more brown than, than plum, like there's the barest hint of, of a plum shade to it, so I found it a little bit disappointing. The first shade in the last set is All American Girl, and it's sort of like a silvery white. The next shade is Nashville, and it's sort of like a grayed out purple, or maybe like a purple taupe. No, I think there's too much purple for it to be purpley taupe, but it's like a grayed out purple shade. The final shade is Bluebird, which I feel like it has some fallout and it doesn't have like the best pay color payoff. Um, it's a deep blue with like charcoal undertones and silver sparkles. So the palette comes with nine shades. It retails for $36 and it's available at Ulta because it's an Ulta exclusive. And as you can see, the book comes with three different looks. The, the day look, the classic look, and the fashion look so that you have an idea of how to use the colors together which is one of the things I really like about um, the Too Faced palettes. I like that they include ideas so you you know can decide what you're gonna do or at least you know have a direction to go in with colors because sometimes um, I know people you know, say well what do I do with these colors I don't know what to do with like like um, I got a lot, I've gotten a lot of questions about the uh, Kat Von T um, Chrysalis palette so I think that having little guides like this is really helpful Overall, I think that if you're a fan of toned down shades, that you will like the Too Faced Country Nashville Nudes palette. Um, if you're a fan of brights, this is one I would skip. So anyway, what do you think of this palette? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching.